hanging out in the gym, and in the next few minutes, I'm going to try to teach you how to play cello. First, take out your cello, and if you already have it, that's good. We're going to have it set right here, so take out your left hand on the board, and just hold it out, and we're going to try to put it <laughs> focus where your cello is on you. And the first thing to do is taking out your end pen, and the way to measure that is with the width of your hand, from like your thumb to the pinky, and you're gonna have to play around with it because I'm not a very tall person, so it has to be a little bit longer than my hand. But make sure it's just really comfortable for you so that the scroll, which is right here, um, is near your ear. And then you're gonna sit up straight, feet flat on the floor, and then have it come to you, the instrument, to your chest. And then have it kind of like angled inward a little bit to the right, so you can see, and later we're going to add the hand and stuff to it. And so that the, uh, this part of the cello rests on your left side. Okay, so we're going to teach you how to do pizzicato, which is just plucking. And you're going to have the, your thumb right here on the right side of the fingerboard. And then you're just going to have it anchored right there and then just pluck each string. And it'll be from C. Let's just try some open patterns with that one. So repeat after me. Try it on your own. Good. Let's try some of the upper ones. Try to stretch it over there. A, A, D, D, A. Try it on your own. Now we're going to add the left hand. I have some tape on here, but I don't know if your instrument will have it, so just know that um, when it's, it says zero on your music, it means open string, like we went over. But from your index finger, that'll be one. Middle finger is two. Ring finger is three. And your pinky finger is four. And they're going to act as a unit, so one is going to be right here, around approximately there on the fingerboard. Two and three for now are going to act together. They're going to move together. And then your fourth finger is going to just set right above here. And we're going to be on the D string for this one. So just repeat after me. Try it on your own. Open. One, two, three, four. Open on A. Good. And so the note names for that would be D, E, F sharp, but we're going to call it Fiche for now, G, and then A. Okay, so try that with me. D, E, Fiche, G, A. Try it on your own. D, E, Fiche, G, A. Now let's try that descending. A, G, B, H, D, D. Try it with me. A, G, B, H, E, D. Try it on your own. A, G, B, H, D, D. Good. And so far that's all you need to start playing cello and all the other stuff will come with it.